Hey guys, my name is Demon Rebuild, and welcome back to another playthrough of Don't Starve Shipwrecked. Now, while the last episode and the ending of the last series might have been really disappointing, and believe me, I am super disappointed, it's kind of good that it gives us a chance to play as the other characters. So, as of now, we've already played, we played as Woody first off, then we played as Walani, and now we're going to try out Wally. So Wally is the chef, he has distinguished tastes, which means that he is pretty picky with his food. If you cook the same thing often, he gets a bit upset with that, so I don't think you get as much of a bonus from food if you eat the same thing again and again. He also cooks in a custom cookware, so he's got his own crock pot, which he can take around wherever, which is awesome. So you already start off with a crock pot. And he has a stylish chef, stylish chef pouch. Freaking couldn't say that last time either. Um, so he's got a backpack with him which has four slots and you can put food in there and it stays fresh that's probably i don't really mind that it's good i guess but it means that you have four spots less than you would otherwise have if you had a backpack and at the start of the game things aren't really going to go off that quickly anyway so i don't really know the point of that but We'll use it to start off with because we don't have a backpack. And we'll see how we go. <sighs> I always love the start of the game. It's my favorite bit, to be honest. So, while it's disappointing that we ended the last game, it's fun to get back into it straight away. I'm actually playing this the same day that I finished the other game because I just, <laughs> just want to play it. I really wanted to play the game and it sucks that I died, but I'm gonna play it anyway. I don't care All right, we've seen that bit heaps of times so I've got my minimap mod I also have my See there's my crock pot. I got my geometric placement mod which is really helpful and now it's time to just collect a bunch of stuff. So we've, it already looks like we've got a fair bit on this island. We've got twigs, we've got grass, obviously. Um, I wanna get some flint so I can smash that. And I'll just order my stuff. Why do you wanna go over there? Go with the rest of you guys. I saw a flint over there. Oh no, the chef patch has eight. They must have updated it. Oh well then. This is interesting. This kind of makes Ali a bit OP. Or Wally. Not Ali. <laughs> yeah, it makes him pretty OP because, like, apart from the getting picky with his food, he's got a backpack where you can put food in it, he's got his own crock pot. Which is like, you rarely, rarely get a crock pot before like day five at least. And you start with that. You start with a backpack, which is probably one of the first things you build anyway, but still. This is pretty OP. Let's hope it gets me a good start. And I can build off that and last longer than I did the last time. I should have actually made a um, pickaxe first. That was pretty dumb. Luckily there's more flint. So now we'll make a pickaxe. Don't do what I did guys. You should always make a pickaxe first. Because then you can get more flint from the rocks that you can mine. It's a classic don't starve. Look at all this grass. That's one thing I didn't have a lot of in my last game. Grass. And it's so useful 
you, you basically need grass for most early things in the game. Most early crafting. So the fact that I didn't have a lot really made it difficult. But I was doing well, that's the most disappointing thing. It was a tough start, and a tough island, and a tough map, but I was doing quite well. So to have to throw that game away. Anyway, enough whining. We got a new game now. We got Wally, Mr. OP, and we're gonna do well. I've decided. Alright, uh, we'll get more rocks while we're here. You don't get flint from these boulders, but rocks are useful just the same. And there's more limpets over there. I don't know why I'm getting seashells. I guess I can build seashell armor eventually, but it's taking up a spot in my inventory, and I'm gonna have to put them somewhere eventually. Can I make a hammer? Yes. Whoop, didn't quite make it. There you go. Because I want to take all this stuff. One wood is good. Two more wood. And this is the best thing. We need that. Get some more stone over here. That'll be useful for my first fire pit. And I still got flint. Oh, I need more flint? Ah, that's not cool. Well, let's get some more wood then. Oh. <laughs> I don't really have a spear to hit him with, but that'll do. I don't need that right now. And I don't have a shovel. Nah. Alright. Well. We'll make do. I need to get some more flint. Oh, another one? Alright. Seeds too. I like seeds. Damn. Silence actually not so bad. More limpets too. And it keeps going. Wow. Don't tell me I've got the Holy Grail already. Don't tell me. It can't be. I saw a flint. I need that. I'll get it in a sec. Oh, three flint. Four flint. Hello? Alright, I can make a machete now. Because I need a boat. I need this too. I think it was four bamboo and three vines? Or three bamboo and four vines? I don't I don't know. We'll just get a bunch of each. And there's that totally normal tree. I didn't even pick it up. Come on. Yay. Come on, can we get this before it's dark? This is a weird island. It's just like a square piece in the middle. And there are no monkeys here. I think that's the most unusual thing. Although, in most of the ones I remember, I haven't seen any monkeys on the starting place, so... And it looks like they've updated the geometric placement thing. Looks different. Hmm. Alright. Well, let's test this out. Nice. Alright, what shall I cook? Meat, two berries, and a limpet. 
That should make meatballs. Yeah. Oh, it'd be good if I could get a shovel. Ah, oh, shit. Nice. Alright, um, not quite hungry yet. Pick that up. <laughs> That's so cool. And I'll put that in my pouch. Alright. Um, boats. I can make a raft. It was four and three, so I was right. I was right, guys. I think this island has been pretty much tapped. We'll just get the few more things that are here. It'd be good if I could... Uh, there's not much I need from a science machine apart from the shovel. I've already got a backpack. And a spear, I guess, would be handy. But I don't have that much flint anyway. I have enough, but... I don't know. We'll see if there's gold. It'd be useful. And it'd help to prototype stuff, I guess. We're getting quite a lot of grass. Pick it. Come on. And our sanity is fine, so... I'm just picking it up to keep it, really. Just a little bit more. Wow, there's actually quite a lot here. This is a very generous start. They must be like, oh, this guy sucks, he keeps dying at, like, day 30. We'll give him a good start this time. With plenty of things, so he's got no excuse. And then we're going to embarrass him <laughs> later on in the game. That's probably what's going on, right? It's classic clay. Alright, let's look for... Oh, I'll eat my meatballs. Delectable. So he likes that one. For now. No, I don't think there are any here. So let's get the heck off this island. Make a nice raft. And let's go. Take some seaweed. Beautiful. Okay, so I'm a bit more drilled in finding islands now. I don't just head off into the middle of the ocean. You sort of just skirt around this barrier between the light blue and the dark blue. And if you keep going around there, you should eventually find another island. That's what I've discovered anyway. It might be a bit tedious, but if you if you do this long enough, you should find most, if not all, the other islands. Probably not all, but definitely most. Ooh, it'd be, if we found floaty boaty knights, I would just I'd cry. That'd be amazing. We didn't find them last time, and that meant we couldn't build a icebox which really really sucks iceboxes are so great oh we should also get some freaking this stuff while we're here might as well it's useful it's very useful actually although we can't stay around too long or else the oh the sharks will come Okay, that's five. We'll just get one more thing and then we'll head off. There's a shitload of it over here, so whenever we need it, well, we'll you know where we're going. We're going here. That's where we're going. Alright, so that was the end of that. Was that something up there? No, I don't think so. Some seagulls. Hmm. 
So there should be an island sort of... Yep, here we go. And there's gold. Thank you, game. Thank you. Been very friendly at the moment. Although I bet there will be monkeys here. I can hear spiders. Actually, meat would be pretty good. Oh, I don't have a spear. Let's make one. Let's make a spear. What is this? Backpack. I don't need one. How strange is that? Rope. Spear. Um. Put that over there. Take that too. And let's fight this. I heard it. Um. Alright, well, I definitely hear him now. Boy. He's trying to fight the butterfly. Snakeskin. That's okay. Oh, shit. Oh, I've never actually heard his voice. Hmm. Need to get them on the same page, I think. Aw, oh, you guys. Come on. Alright, well. Snakeskin is cool. I like it. Oh, shit. We need to... Make a fire. Oh, look at that. It's nice and yellow. They really updated that mod. It looks nice. If you modders are watching, you did a good job. Looks very nice. I appreciate the good work. <laughs> okay, let's get out my fancy schmancy crock pot and cook some food, I guess. What's that going to make? No, let's get rid of that and put an egg in there, just to make something different. And... I don't need that. I'll plant that. Oh, that's going to catch fire, isn't it? I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Oh, and no, I did build a shovel. <sighs> Go me. Oh, cute, no? I don't know why. I, I just reckon he would have... Like a French accent. Cute, no? Oh. What are you guys doing? I will butcher you. Oh. Now they're gonna come. Alright, well We've got plenty of stuff I actually need more space It sucks, you really need to find a place to settle Like really, really early in the game Because otherwise you just run out of space Like as you can see, I have already run out of space Need a shovel. There you go. Space is gone. So now I can't pick up like... I wanted to pick up some grass and stuff and plant it somewhere else. But I can't do that now. Because i got no space. Oh well. I need some gold. Now oh, i got no space. <laughs> oh, why is that in a different spot? There you go. Alright. We definitely need more gold. So if I find any, if you guys find any, just give me a shout out and I'll go get it, alright? What is that weird noise? It sounds like an opera singer. Can you hear it? Can't hear it anymore. 
Hello, guys. <sighs> I didn't miss you. I'll admit, you're kind of helpful sometimes, but... I reckon when I get a good base set up, I'll just make like a little enclosure. Just shut off from the world, and I'll build like... 10 of those huts, and they can just go crazy. They can, I'll chuck in like a, a piece of gold, and they can just fight over it. I don't care. Just have like a death pit, you guys can fight over it <laughs> for food. Or <laughs> that sounds a bit mean. Ah, oh, here they come, they found me. Guys, come on. I was having a good time until you came. Maybe I should. I've got no space. Huh. You can have that. I don't need the balloons. Probably need this stuff a bit more. Oh, actually, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I was going to say I should dig it up, but I can't carry both. I can only carry one. I'll collect this stuff while I'm here. I figure. Because next I'll probably find place that's completely different and it won't have any of this stuff. I would consider settling here, but it seems to only be this biome, which is okay, but it's not my favorite biome. I kind of want a land with a bit of everything, if that's possible. I didn't really look that hard for it last time, I just sort of went, yeah, whatever, I'll just settle here. And I settled on like the most inhospitable place I could find. <laughs> but this time, I'm definitely going to be a bit more picky. Oh, look at this. The monkeys haven't even got to it yet. You can take that coconut, I'll take all your berries. And you've already got the swamp over there. Wow, there are a lot of berries. Wow. Lucky I can put them in my stay fresh pouch. Oh, come on. Lucky you get flint back from this. Otherwise I'd be in real trouble. But the gold, that's super important. Whoa, this is huge. Look at this place. Oh, and it's got this terrain. I like this terrain. Look at that green color. It's beautiful. Beautiful. I'm not picking it up because I don't have space. Okay. Interesting. And then this is just a little spit of land. Oh, and it's got this. Don't tell me there are water beefalo. No, it's too small for water beefalo. <laughs> I don't know, maybe if I go back and get my little boat, my little raft, I can take a look. And I've got 40 rocks. You know, this island is actually pretty nice. Look at that. Oh, wow. It's got stuff already set up for me. This is a very, very generous start, I have to say. I don't think I've ever been treated this nicely by clay. I really appreciate it, guys. Thank you so much. Uh, Alright, where did I put my boat? Where did I put my boat? It's over there, isn't it? See, the minimap is so useful. So useful. I don't have any monster meat, I don't think. I just wanna... I need food. I need food. I wanna, like, kinda drive it a little bit upstream. Actually, let's go around this side. See if there's anything down here. 
We can make our way, keep going around the way we were heading before. We're not going to get very far before night time anyway. And that's pretty much it. <laughs> okay. Let's make a little fire over here. And get some more of this stuff. Fight, yeah, fight. Alright, need to eat with my nice fancy crock pot. Let's see what that makes. Oh, they're fighting. That's awesome. Get this while I'm waiting. Oh, jam. I used all my things for that. How did it make jam? I only put two in there. Oh well, I guess he'll like it. Alright, egg. Limpet. Two berries. That's gonna make... That will make... Um, ratatouille, I'm guessing. Alright guys, I gotta end that episode there. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying it. Hopefully this playthrough goes a little bit smoother than the last one. It seems to be doing that for the moment, but you never know. Clay is a cruel mistress and you give him, they give you a bit of hope and then they just rip it away from you. <laughs> so it'll be interesting to see what happens from here. Anyway guys, thanks for watching again. Take care. It's just like trying to sleep. Oh, it's awake. Whoa. The fuck? I fell asleep. Me too. <laughs> oh, oh fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god, no! Come on! <laughs>